And then just make sure we're in the right account, which we are. That's the one at the top, the top left. Yep. Perfect. Okay. And then also whenever, whenever I'm, I'm looking at the dashboard like this, mm -hmm. I always want to want to view it in lifetime view. So right there, the top, right, you have this month, January 1st through the fourth, hit that drop down in the top, right. And, yep. and go to lifetime view, go to oh, lifetime okay. view, try to always look at it in lifetime view. And, 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 one reason for it is it just gives you more metrics. It gives you that okay. green bar. So it shows you how much money of the amount was spent. So 35 gotcha. of 35, for example, it will show you that number if the ad is off and it will show you that number if the ad is on. So if the ad was okay. on, it will show $17 of 35. So yep. it's, it's, kinda, it's just a different view to look at the dashboard. Okay. Um, so then here's what we want to do. Also, we always want to make sure that the, in the top right, that blue button, we always want to make sure we clear that out. So the review and publish three, let's click on that and see what that is real quick. Up there, okay. Let's, do, do, let's do. always make sure we clean this out. Um, so this is the new ad. Okay, so this was, is this like, was this like a like a demo ad or was, was this like a test ad or was this, what was this? Might have been a test one, I'm guessing. Okay, let's just get rid of it. Let's let's click the, the bottom the, the, or check the box. Yeah, there you go, the bottom left. Yep. And then just hit publish. Okay, yeah, cool. I never Good. really I haven't run anything in quite a while on here. So, okay. Okay, good. So then what we'll so. do is let's, um, you have a hundred dollars daily on that second ad new campaign. Yep. Let's see what that is real quick. What, what is that real quick? Let's I think um, that was something we, uh, click on that. Yeah. Just go ahead and click right there. there. Go. go ahead and just click. I think that's something we played around with. Click on the middle tab. Actually, that is the middle tab. Click on, click on the third tab to the right ads for one campaign. Um, yeah, I think we we're just playing around with that one. So yeah. let's just get rid of that one. Just check the box and then just hit the trash can. Trash can. Delete that one. Where is the trash? There it is. Dude. Okay, cool. So we get rid of that one. Okay, <sighs> cool. So we should be, we should be good. Now, um, uncheck that box right where it says one selected or uncheck the X. Yeah. The, the blue. Yeah. There you go. Okay. So now we got first video ad. Okay. So that. Was that an old ad? Uh, that was something we were just playing around with the first uh, two, the first ad video, first ad video. Those are just something we were playing around with at one time. Okay, okay. So then now we're gonna just run the intro video then. Yep. Perfect. So it's already on your business page. Yep. So now what I would do is I would I would pin it to the top. Did you pin it on the business page? Like, uh, yes, I believe I perfect. did here. Okay. Awesome. Like we'll just park it at the top. It's a great video to have at the top, you know, an intro. Go. There it goes. Yeah, there it is right there. Oh, perfect, man. Perfect. Hey, there's me. Hey, awesome. where'd I go? I love it. Okay. Where cool, man. Where did I go here? Where the heck did I click? You clicked on manage jobs. Let's Not sure what I did there. Page. There we go. There we go. Cool, man. Really see, cool. That's, awesome. That's just two dude. minutes of me and being see, a You have great. Here. Um, colors as well. That red is going to just stand yep. out, man. Yep, like, it pops. It. it pops. Yeah, dude. Red logo, red, yep. red attire. Like that's really cool. And then, you, and then, and then a person clicks and they go to your red page. Yep. Like that's really cool. That's really, really cool. Okay. So the, the video's on there. Now let's go to the ads yep. manager and we just simply run it from here. Make one. <laughs> yes. So we're going so go to click on the green probably. button. Yeah. The, the create. All right. And then what we'll do is we're going to go the first ad, the intro, it's always video views. So we'll go video views and then we'll hit the drop down. And then right there, let's hit that drop down and let's just simply name it the campaign. Let's give it a title. We'll just name it intro video work, clear work. intro video, put intro video. And then, and then in parentheses, put video views. So what you always want to do is get in the habit of, of, of titling it, titling it, whatever it is. And then mm -hmm. in parentheses, is the actual objective. The objective gotcha. would be video views or the objective would be conversions. Gotcha, you know I mean? gotcha. Um, and then the ad set, in your case, we're targeting our local area and we're gonna target one one city because that one city will cover everything. Yep. So type in the one city that we're gonna hit right here. Just give that the get, name that name that the, the title of the ad set uh, tab. So whatever that one city is, I guess it'd be I'll probably go walk you shall. And then, and then, how far out is fifty miles from that? Um, like, is uh, it fifty miles 
far, like northeast, south, and west from the middle. If I dropped a pin in the middle of that yeah. city. If you go to Waukesha, if you go 50 miles south, you're actually in Illinois. Okay, so we don't want to go 50 then. And then 50 miles, well, even 10 miles to the east, I'm in a lake, <laughs> Lake Michigan. Okay, okay. So it's actually... So um, then... So I should be... Let me see here. Be... Whatever that number is, it'd be good to put it in the parentheses. In parentheses. So right next to that city, put it in parentheses. So I, can, I can go show you where... So I kind of live in a weird place. Walk. Isha. Well, there's not a spell. It will show. Do, 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 do. Damn, bro, it's 23 degrees right now? Yeah. Shit. Yeah, it's, it's, I got, I got snow outside. I got, Eight inches of snow outside right now. No way, bro. Eight inches? Yeah. yeah. You're it's like, quite... yeah, that shit's normal yeah, for you. That's huh? normal, yeah. So yeah, wow. here's here's Waukesha. Okay. So, so yeah, you go damn, over you here, the you're on the lake, and then down where the line is here. That's Illinois below there. Okay, okay. So then why don't you just dominate 20 miles? So that... Yeah. Or 10, I... even 10 miles. I mean, it's up I to could you. Even, I could even put a I could put a city out over in this area well what we want to do ideally is just is just extend the miles the miles the radius right. so mm -hmm. that way if we put 15 miles it'll cover that city yeah, or 20 cover, miles you know yeah 20 miles are probably pretty good because i'll probably get you up to i'll be in this area right here yeah that's perfect so let's go 20 we just let's go 20. Let's go 20 miles okay so in parentheses just put 20 uh, over here waukesha 20 yeah 20 miles perfect and then the ad, same thing, intro video, video views, same, same video. So, so that you could just put that in there in the, in the ad. So that's just titling each tab um, for your reference. You know, you only, you're the only one that sees that. Yep. So we'll hit continue. And that um, is, is part one of, of step one of, of tab number one. And then we'll come over here where it's going to ask us if we're in a special ad category and you actually are. So you're going to hit that special ad category. You're going to, you're going to turn it on. Special, special ad, ad category. Right there. Okay. And you're going to go with housing. So hit okay. the drop down. I kind of remember all housing. this stuff now. Yes. And then we'll just scroll down and we're going to leave all this the same. And we'll go into campaign budget optimization once we start running conversion ads. Like okay. once we actually start going for the lead capture right here, we're mm -hmm. only going for video views to kind of get our face out there and get our, get our yep. audience formed up to us. That um, makes sense. And, and, and that's video views. So we don't mm -hmm. need campaign budget optimization, but we will be focused on that in the future. So the down, future, yeah. just hit next. We're good here. Housing, um, video views. We're good. So that's tab number one. Tab number two is the actual city. So this is where we're going to put in the city. This is where we're going to put in our budget. Mm -hmm. This is where we'll change the start date for Wednesday. Um, yeah. and, then, and then the daily budget, what I would do with that is I would hit the drop down and go lifetime. So let's go lifetime budget. And then, and then whatever the budget may be, man. Like the way I kind of look at it and the way I kind of budget it is I look at it per month and like mm -hmm. whatever that monthly budget may be, I'll just divide it by four. Like if I plan on yep. putting out four videos, if I plan on putting out four videos, then, then, and, and four ads in that given month, whatever the monthly budget is divided by four, that mm -hmm. amount should go towards this first video. Gotcha. Gotcha. You know, so. So if it was like yep. 200 bucks, be 50, I guess. Ex exactly, dude. 50 bucks lifetime budget. And, and, and I'd let that thing run for as long as you want. I mean, I'd, I'd run it for a week. If, mm -hmm. if we're really going to strategically run one every week then this one's going to go out for a seven day period. Mm -hmm. If, if, if we're going to, if we want to run it a little longer, okay, cool. Yep. Push it out for two weeks mm -hmm. and, and run it for two weeks. And then on that third, on that, on the start of the third week, be ready yep. for your next ad, mm -hmm. you know? So it's, it's kind of up to you. Like, because all we're doing with this one is going to, we're going to build an audience of people that watch the video. All those who watch the video are going to go into a custom audience Mm -hmm. And we're going to retarget that custom audience with our next ad. And the next ad is going to be conversions when we're okay. giving away our PDF. Gotcha. You know? Gotcha. So it can go as long as you want. A week, two weeks. It will go. 
I'll go two weeks, I guess. Yeah, start, go start two weeks. Here. Perfect. So then let's change that start date. Let's change so the end date. And, and 6th to the 20th, I guess, here. And let's do... Or, um, where are we? The exact oh, time. Yeah, back to January here. And what I do, too, also, um, is I'll set it for the morning. So 6 a.m. Yeah. local time um, is, is when I normally re release a new ad. Um, that way it's just first thing in the morning and it goes live. Yep. And why, why I have it six? What the heck here? No. Zero there. Six. There we go. Okay. Then the, the date then, changed on you as well. Oh, that's not very nice. Okay, there we go. And the end time in the evening six, probably? Same. Yep, 6 o'clock, 6 a.m. 6 a.m. Zeros. And then 6 a.m. Okay. Perfect. That looks good there. So here's the goal. The goal is on the 21st is to have that next ad ready. Mm -hmm. And that okay. next ad is going to be conversions. That's when we're going to start going for leads. And so that next ad is a simple, again, what I would do, man, what I touched on with you in the beginning is, is simply documenting your day, can, like, yeah. like little, little bits of your day, turn mm -hmm. it into a short video. Yep. And, and, and at the end of the video, the call to action is to click, learn more, to go mm -hmm. over to your page, to download your free PDF. Okay. So that'll work. That next video should be ready to go live on the 21st. Okay. Okay. And you put in that, a perfect I put, world. I mean, shit happens, yep. but in a perfect yep. <laughs> world, you know, that's kind of what you mm -hmm. want to plan for. So I can even do stuff on my own house here. Hey, I'm looking at yes, the electric Heck panel yeah. or something. Heck and... yeah, bro. Heck yeah. Turn your house into a freaking yep. video tutorial. Yes, mm -hmm. dude, for sure. I can get up on the roof when there's no snow on it, but <laughs> yeah, right now there's snow on it, so yeah dude that's that's a good idea that's a mm -hmm. great idea because yeah sometimes it's not always the easiest to do a video when i'm actually working working but mm -hmm. I, if mm -hmm. i have a friend's houses family houses that i can go to to do a, a video as well so mm -hmm. okay. i got a few ideas that i can go through and I, I inspect like plumbing and electrical and hvac stuff so you can uh -huh. do a little short video on each one of those components of a house so good Okay. Have a little bit of education along with it too. So perfect, man. Perfect. Perfect. Okay. So let's scroll down. We got, um, we don't need anything on the custom audiences just yet. Mm -hmm. um, and locations, that's what will change. The United States will change that to your city and then just change the mileage or the radius. You just mm -hmm. X out Dude. US. Right. Yeah. You just X it out there. And then also, you'll always want to pay attention to that drop down. But go ahead and put in the city, cool. okay. and then we'll change. I see what you're there. Yeah, we'll change that drop down. Waukesha, Waukesha, Wisconsin. Oh, I like to put the. Go ahead and hit the drop down, the blue. Yeah, click on the blue. That. Are you gonna go county, or did you mean to choose that? Um, I'm thinking. I guess. I think Waukesha County would probably be okay. Okay, because even 20 miles south, east, west, and north will be just fine from the county. Okay. Or that's a, so, is a city better than a county? I don't know. No, that's, yeah, I don't know either. Hit the drop down real quick. Right there. Yeah, hit that drop. Yeah, yeah right there. Right there. Perfect. Yep. And then, um, well, actually, you know what? X out, X out, X out of it and, and type it in again. Because it should, it should uh, show the, the mileage. It should give you the option to change the, the radius. Okay, go on here. Walk I, I didn't see it there. Lucky. Actually, I because I think you went, yeah, you didn't hit the drop down on people living in. Okay. Now, people now we'll show you the miles. There we go. Now it's showing okay. you thirty five. So change that thirty five to twenty. Let's go. Twenty miles. Perfect. Perfect. Yeah, okay. That covers pretty good. There it hits the lake. Yeah, it goes man. down south. Goes awesome. Out here. Perfect. Okay, so, so twenty miles do... is the number. Do yeah, this people living in. No, we'll go people living in this location. People living, so, yep. Yeah, there we go. Perfect. <laughs> okay, cool. So let's scroll down. And then age. Actually, you cannot change age. You cannot change yep. age. You cannot change gender. So, um, and then the detailed targeting. Yep. What I would do in the detailed targeting is I would leave it wide open. Like I would leave it mm -hmm. wide open. You're targeting a small area. Um, yep. Let everyone and their mother see that video. Um, 
And then, so we don't need any detail targeting in, in language, maybe, maybe change the language, maybe go English, English yeah. on the language, just in case, um, since we are targeting everyone, let's just go English. English, English US, I guess that'll work. Yeah. Okay, perfect. So we scroll down and then we're going to leave it. You know what we're going to, what we're going to do is we're going to go, we're going to go manual placement. Since it's since it's a uh, um, oh shit, you can go both. You can go either way. I would go since it's fifty bucks. Like I would want all that spent on just one platform, like one mm -hmm. part of Facebook, which would which I would uncheck Instagram. I would uncheck Messenger. I would uncheck Audience Network, and then scroll down, and I would uncheck I would uncheck everything except for newsfeed. So leave the Facebook newsfeed, uncheck everything else. Now I do it this way when I have a smaller budget, 50 bucks. It's not like we're spending 500 bucks, right? So 50 bucks, yep. still a decent budget, but it's still considered a smaller budget. So I yep. want to make sure that every freaking penny goes to the most visible area yep. on Facebook. And that's the newsfeed. So yep. now Facebook, when they do run the ad, they do place it even if you go automatic placement and you give facebook the ability to put it everywhere they still are very mm -hmm. good at allocating the funds to wherever the the traffic is at so they'll still do a good job but we'll just go a step further and say hey wait let let, let me manually do it like let me just show mm -hmm. you where to put it like just put it yep. on, on the news feed you know so this is just making sure that we get the most bang for our buck yep okay so scroll down we'll go a little below and we are done so we'll hit next and then this is the last final step we're going to simply grab the post from our business page, page. and all you're going to do is click on um create ad right there create ad ad setup create, create oh, ad hit the ahead. drop down and then go use existing, existing post. post yeah there you go and then we'll hit select post click yeah and then just go ahead and find uh, that video, which I believe video is right that. there. Perfect. Okay, cool. And then we hit continue. And because you already have the landing page, sometimes the landing page isn't necessary for this first one because all we're shooting for are views. Mm -hmm. We're not shooting for engagement. We're not shooting for people to comment or people to click and go to your landing page. That's not this kind of ad. It's simply for video views. Yep. But since you already have the landing page, it doesn't hurt to just simply attach it. So. Mm -hmm. Let's go to Kartra. Let's get your landing page link. Let's copy uh, the link and let's just simply put it in. We'll, we'll put it in, put it in as the call to action button and just, and just leave it there. So it'll say, learn more. And if anybody ever wants to click on it in the future, then at least it'll take them to, to our landing page. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah. Pages My here. pages. And we'll just simply click on the three dots and just get, get code or link or whatever it, whatever it is get code yeah. or link yeah get code or link perfect so all we'll do is we'll simply put it in we'll attach it to the to the post to the ad and we'll now have a learn more button there now as we go on to our next ad our our, our very next ad after this one that's when we go conversions not video views that's when we go conversions and our whole objective is to drive people to this link. Mm -hmm. That's our next ad. But right now we'll just put it here just for the hell of it. So go ahead and click on right below. You see call to action. So okay. scroll down a bit, click on the ad button and we're going to, we're going to go with learn more. All so, right. Yeah, there you go. Perfect. Paste it in there and then we'll simply update post. Post. Okay, so we'll now see the learn more button. This is exciting. Yes, <laughs> awesome. And and then also take note, you know, at least a mental note on 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 the way it looks. Like we have mm -hmm. the title, right? We have the title. We have the the what are those hashtags? Yep. Okay, we have the hashtags and then below we have the website address and we have the what Facebook calls your your title which is your mm -hmm. headline which is the the home the humble home inspection yep. right to the left of the learn more button so 
right there, that humble home inspection, because it gives you the ability to write something longer, but you never mm -hmm. want to write anything longer because it's not going to show up. Like if you wrote, if you wrote at the bottom, humble home inspection, download your free PDF, like that's already too long. So, so mm -hmm. you would have saw three dots right there. It would have said humble okay. home inspection, dot, dot, dot. Yep. So you want to just have it clean. Like you want it to look clean, humble home mm -hmm. inspection. Um, and, and for example, on our next ad, on our next ad, it won't be humble home inspection right there. We'll put in the headline in the title, we'll put right there, download your free PDF. Okay. Right. I like call yep. to action because that's the real estate we get. That's, that's the little <laughs> space that we get to write something catchy. Mm -hmm. Um, now on the dot com, you'll notice how Kartra, right? It yep. says Kartra in that link, mm -hmm. right? So what you can do is you can always put something else. So um, scroll down. It's that URL parameters, that option, optional. Yep. Do you have humblehomeinspections.com? You do, right? Yeah. Yep. Why don't you put that in there? Put that, put that right there. You have to do the www in there or just, um, the... just, just no www, just the, just the, the URL. Yeah. Perfect. Gotcha. Make sure I spell it right. Because there if we, we put that there, that looks a, a little better than having the word Kartra, Kartra. in yep. there. I think it'll update here by itself. Maybe. I think it's thinking. Is it still thinking? Um, Might be thinking still. Let's see. Scroll down just a bit. Scroll down. Yeah, I'll that's where that's where there. it goes. So maybe when the ad goes live, um, mm -hmm. then I'll update. <clears throat> but that that should be that should be it. So we're that should be good enough. That should be good enough. Do I do anything? It should update. Yes. Yeah, okay, so that says introduct. That's all good up here, you think? Introductory yeah, video? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then also another thing, when you put up your video on your business page, yeah, always mm -hmm. triple check what you wrote. Because now okay. now that we're in here, now that we posted it, now, now that we're running the ad, we can no longer mm -hmm. go to your page and edit that. Okay. So, if so you, you have to, to whatever. Page, yep. Yeah, yeah, if you go to your business page right now and try to edit that, you, you're not going to mm -hmm. be able to because it's going to say that it's okay. in the process of running as an ad. Yep. So you have to make sure that the text – the headline, everything is is perfect. And then when mm -hmm. you come over here, you just simply click yep. the green button and it's ready to go. Okay. Okay. So hit the green button. Let's publish it. And then it'll go into review for a few hours. And then you'll get an email when it when it's scheduled and approved to go. And okay. so here's what I do real quick as well. So what I do real quick is all X out of this. So we, we did each each tab, all three steps. Everything is ready to go. X out real quick at the top. Yeah, X out of this little window right here. Yeah. Actually, no, not right there. To the left. To the left. Just this, this section right here. Yeah, there you go. X out of that one. Okay, so now what we can do is we can um, click on edit right there below the title, intro video, video views. Click on the edit right below that title of the, right. of the down. Down. Right there. Oh, there it is. Okay, yeah, pops click on up. That. Okay. So now what we can do while it's in review and even when it's live you can always to the very very right you have that that arrow with the square that drop down above your video to the right up here yeah right there click on that and then scroll down and go to facebook facebook desktop newsfeed facebook de desktop newsfeed click on that and this is going to give you a live view of that ad in real time um and what we want to do is we want to look at it, make sure everything looks good, click on the learn more button, see where it takes you, scroll down. Oh, there it is. There it is. Okay. Bam. So, okay. so there's that. Now, it still has the Kartra link. I don't know why it didn't update, but hopefully it updates. And if not, no big deal. I mean, shit. But, but hopefully mm -hmm. it does. But click on learn more. I click there. Bam. Sweet. Yes, man. So, so this is not an ad to get people to click learn more, but at least mm -hmm. it's there, right? At least the button is there, there if they want to, yeah. In, in case they ever want to in the future. Um, yep. Yeah. So, bro, I'm telling you, dude. Hey, look at me. <laughs> it's freaking game time for you, bro. Like, yeah. if you can keep that red going, keep that red going. It pops, dude. That red freaking mm -hmm. pops. Keep yep. it going. That's why I chose it. <laughs> and, and in the future, the hashtags are not needed. So, okay. so let's write something different in the future. This one's all good. It's just an intro video. We're going to get, you know, a couple mm -hmm. thousand people to view it. It's all good. But um, in the future, no hashtags are necessary. 
Um, yep. And 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 now in the future, every ad from this point on, it's gonna be it's gonna all, it's gonna it's gonna all be about click and learn more. So mm-hmm. maybe in the text, you can put something like click learn more to download your free home inspection yep. PDF. Right. So you can start getting 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 good at, at at writing simple simple text. It doesn't have to be that long. It could be simple. Mm-hmm. You know. Um, and it's all about click and learn more. So at the end of your videos, you'll start, you know, saying that at the end of your videos, that's the call to action. Mm-hmm. It's a click, learn more. So I think on this so, one, I said at the end of the video, I said, Hey, send me a message. If you need a home inspection or give this page a like, so that uh, when you do need one, you'll know exactly who to contact. So yes. I started getting a little bit good at that already. So then the next video is a click, learn more or something below or, and, they'll yes. take it to a free PD. So yes. So Alrighty. the whole strategy, man, is just to it's just is to put out so your goal, why don't you just set it right now? The the budget is 200 200 a month. We're spending 50 mm-hmm. bucks a week on getting videos out to your local area. That 20 mile radius, yep. those people are gonna freaking know you like 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 you're their neighbor. Like mm-hmm. that's what this is gonna be. So 200 set start there, bro. Start there and let let's let's play with that number. And, and let's go yep. from there. Let's let and this one run for a couple weeks and then um, let's get Hopefully ready. For somebody our, watches our... it. <laughs> Dude, share it. Like you can, you can, once it goes live, share it, yep. share it to your personal page, share it to your business page, mm-hmm. even though people are probably for all over the place, but still share it. It's all good. Just share it. Mm-hmm. Um, and then let's check one last thing, go to your ads manager and let's make sure we have our custom audience set up, which I'm pretty sure we do. Yeah, we probably do. So let's X or... out of this one. Out of here. Let's just click on yeah. Let's click on the dots to the left. Dots to the left. Nine dots. All right. And click on audiences. Audiences. Yep. Uh, and stuff spot to get real around here. Yes. Yes, sir. It's exciting and scary at the same. No, bro. Have fun with it, man. You're gonna do great. It's all about that video. So, so again. I, mm-hmm. I, I know I had to have touched on this before, but if not, then I'll, I'll say it again. This one's going to run for two weeks, but what I want you to do is I want mm-hmm. you to get in, in the habit of, of, of making yeah, a, new a video, video every out. week, mm-hmm. every week, every week. So today, what's today today or, or no, it goes live on Friday or Wednesday, yeah, Wednesday every yeah. Wednesday, bro. There needs to be a new video on that business page, regardless if you're going to run it as an ad or not. Okay. Now it needs to be prepped as if it's going to be an ad. So in the ad at or in the video at the end, there needs to be the call to action. Hey guys, and by the way, click learn more. And even if we don't run it as an ad, we can still put the learn more button. So mm-hmm. so get in the habit, develop the discipline of putting out putting up a new video every seven days, regardless if it's gonna be an ad or not, but prep mm-hmm. it as if it is an ad. Okay. Because some weeks you'll have you'll have one video going and, and you're capturing, you know, a good amount of leads and you don't necessarily have to start the new ad right away. But sometimes if we're not capturing a good amount of leads, we want to release that new ad right away. And so we want it to at least be on the business page ready to, ready to deploy at any time. Gotcha, gotcha. Okay, so- That makes sense. So these 30 seconds of home inspection greatness, is that the- let's that, see. I ran that a long time ago. Okay, so then, okay, so then are we in the right? Yeah, we're in the right account. So let's set up a custom audience. We don't have a custom audience for that video. So let's hit the blue it. button, create audience. audience. And then let's go custom audiences or custom audience. And all we're going to do is simply go with video. So we'll click on that and we'll go video. And then we're going to simply click in the box, choose a content type. Yeah. Click that. And then just go, I would go 25%. 25% is when you're, is when you're separating those who just randomly watch a few seconds accidentally click on it (laughs) yeah accidentally click on it like versus people that actually watched a good amount Mm -hmm. 25 percent is good to start with so click choose video click on choose video and and find that video so hit the drop down right at the top yeah there you go that page yeah facebook page and then go to your other page wrong one here let's go here that'll help okay so check that box that box to the left and then we'll go confirm and then um We'll just simply give it a name. So you mm-hmm. can leave the 365. That's fine. So just audience name, intro video, 20 in, intro video, and then in parentheses, 25%. Perfect. So now from this point on, 
everyone is going to be put into this audience. And this will, okay. be, this will be an audience that you'll always retarget with every ad from this point on. So when we run our next ad, we're retargeting everyone who watched this one. When we run our, our fourth ad, we're retargeting everyone who watched this one. Mm-hmm. So this is kind of the, 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 the beginning, man. This is the beginning. This is how we really break into a cold audience. Gotcha, gotcha. So create audience Sweet. and we're good. Thanks for creating a custom audience. Oh, thanks. Yeah, so you're good. So let that bad boy run, bro. Let that bad boy run. Everything else is in order. What I would do though, do you have do you have your emails set up in the sequence for for after they when after they download your PDF? Yeah, there's ten or eleven emails awesome, in a sequence awesome. right now. Awesome, bro. So we're ready, dude. We're locked and loaded. We're ready to go. <laughs> All you need to focus on, bro. Here here's this here here's the homework and here's our 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 our, our call to action. Everything is set up. Kartra, mm-hmm. you have the pages, you have the email sequences, the PDF is uploaded, yep. everything is ready to go. All you need to focus on from this point on is making a new video every mm-hmm. single week. That's okay. it. And it could be short, tutorial, content based, educated mm-hmm. related, with a call to action at the end to click learn more and download your PDF. That's gotcha, it. Gotcha. That's it, bro. That is it. That is it. There's nothing else to do. If you can stay focused on that and stay consistent with that mm-hmm. we will take over your entire local area that's just the way it is nothing wrong with that but but i'm here to tell you and i i know i had to mention this before where everyone drops the ball is they're not consistent with those videos mm-hmm. that's where they that's all drop the ball. that's <laughs> yep. where they all drop the ball bro like i'll mm-hmm. end up teaching people all of this shit and at the end of it they, they haven't put the out their last video <laughs> yep yeah yeah they haven't put out a video in three weeks mm-hmm. i'm I like see. damn dude you Something know, you so, just had to get comfortable with uh, doing it. Even even the yeah. introductory video, it it was a little bit awkward trying to talk into a camera and make sure making sure I'm looking in the right part of the camera. And bro, but you have to you have to always keep in mind that awkwardness is normal. That mm-hmm, awkward yep. awkwardness is relatable. Yep. When the average consumer is looking at that awkwardness, they're looking at that shit as if that's them. Mm-hmm. We're all awkward, bro. We're yep. all freaking camera shy. Mm-hmm. All of us. So the moment I can see you and your camera is shaking and you freaking look a little nervous, the more I can relate to you. Yep. So that's why my last my last client, my last call that I was on prior to you, he's mm-hmm. like, David, I have a professional camera crew coming out on Friday. We're going to do this freaking video. I'm like, bro, what are you doing? Like, no, <laughs> dude, like you don't need none of that. Sh- costing them 500 bucks. I'm like, wow. dude, you don't need none of that shit, bro. Like, you just need a camera not, on your phone. <laughs> that's not going to do it for you. Like social media is social media. Mm-hmm. We gravitate and we relate to the average person. We're all normal people. Yep. So you exactly. have to keep it that normal with that shaky cell phone and that authentic authenticity of you, people Mm -hmm. have to see that, you know, that's the most engaged, that's the most engaged content on social media. That is what makes up social media. It's not the Hollywood blockbuster, highly produced Denzel Washington videos, Mm -hmm. you know, leave that for freaking AMC theater when they reopen, but not here. (laughs) Keep it simple on your cell phone and just anything educated, you know, content educated based that's, that makes a good video. That'll work. You know, that's kind so, of what I put in my, that's why it's kind of in my introductory video is that in the first time that someone actually sees or, or meets their home inspector is at the actual home inspection. Mm-hmm. And it's kind of, it's awkward working with somebody and I'm going to be there for a few hours. I think it'd be better for people to have a, a visual of who you're working with Heck yeah dude versus yeah. Hey, who's who's this guy showing up is this right? inspector over here is this guy gonna be a douchebag yes, or bro. Yes. how is he gonna be but if my face is yes. out there and people are seeing hey he's just a normal guy he seems smart not a bad looking dude or something like that yes dude that, uh, yes people will like that so that's kind of what i'm no so going you're for exactly and... right that's exactly what it is mm-hmm you know, that's exactly what it is. And that, and that, and like, uh, that's why, like, I'm everything I'm teaching you is from just personal experience and what I do with clients and what I do with myself. Like, in my case, it's my YouTube channel. Mm-hmm. So, because I have so many videos on YouTube, people relate to me, people trust me, people are like, damn, this guy really knows what he's doing, you know, because yep. he has, and it's because of video. And that's what I tell my friends all the time, my clients all the time. I'm like, dude, the only reason now you're, you're, you're a little different because you came from Facebook. You even came from a, a client of mine already. But if mm-hmm. it wasn't for that, chances are you would have came from YouTube. You would have found me on YouTube. Everyone finds me yep. on YouTube nowadays. And, and the only, and I tell it to them all the time. I'm like, dude, 
the only reason why you reached out and scheduled a call with me is because you kept seeing my videos. Yep, exactly. And and because my videos are very uncut, they're very un you know edited. Like I don't, they're not. There's nothing polished about them. Like they're just mm -hmm. random, authentic videos that I don't even know how to edit. Because it's yeah. that basic, people can relate. Mm -hmm. You know, and that and that that's yeah, man. Like I can't stress it enough. So keep it simple, have fun, bro, and yeah. and let's talk in a couple weeks. All right, that sounds good. Yeah. But like... if there's any other cartridge site, it, like if you need anything else on that site, schedule a call whenever the hell you need me. Okay. But um, let this one run, yeah. and then and then just plan for that next video. What be before you schedule the next call, do that next video. Yep. That yeah, next video should be that, up on uh, the twenty first. Yeah, I'll probably do that in the next uh, few days here, and I actually have Perfect. a have an inspection tomorrow, which is it's nice starting off the year with a nice. first inspection nice. on the uh, five days into it. So that's really nice. So heck yeah, bro. I'm, heck I'm yeah. hoping to uh, at least double what I did. Uh, this past year, if not triple, it would be really nice. Let's do it, bro. Let's do it. And <laughs> and at the same time, always make sure that video, that phone is held horizontal, right? Yep. For Facebook. Mm -hmm. And at the same time, what we might as well do, what you might as well do is you might as well start a YouTube channel. You might as well start putting these videos up on YouTube as yep. well. Yeah, I do have one start and there's a couple okay. of videos on there. So I can definitely upload From that From this one point on, every there. video we do for an ad, it's for YouTube as well. Okay. Might as well. Like, might as well. Park it on YouTube, and I'll show you how to build out the YouTube channel as well. My YouTube channel is growing pretty fast right now. So that sounds good. I'll teach you all that after. All this fun stuff we get to learn. It's kind of exciting. Game time, bro. Let's do it. Happy Sweet. New Year, man. Yeah, Happy New Year, and I get to uh, play in the snow for the next uh, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, two, yeah, three man. months, I guess. Yeah, it doesn't fun. really get above freezing until March now. So. You'll be in the snow. I'll be at the beach. Oh man, I, I kind of want to go to the beach now. <laughs> I kind of want to go to the snow. <laughs> well, you can come up here. We'll we'll show you some snow and such. Oh, It'll man, stick around I for wish. a while. So I love sweet, it. Sweet, sweet. All right. Well, yeah. Appreciate you going through all this uh, stuff with Sounds me good, here Dave. and getting me set up. And yeah, hopefully it will run. It'll do its thing. And yes, maybe we'll get some. Uh, maybe maybe some people will contact me in the next couple of weeks just based on the video it was like hey i'm looking for a home inspector kind yes, of yes man yes but again once we run that conversions it's all about the conversions ad mm -hmm. but yeah you can you can get lucky and someone can hit learn more and schedule something but, yeah. but it's really on our next ad like let's break into the cold audience first with this ad and then we start capturing leads yep. yeah yeah we'll see how, how it all goes but i think it's gonna be it's probably the best bang for the buck for marketing and advertising yes, versus bro. yes anything else out there so take over the facebook news feed trust yep. me that sounds good that sounds good so all right well, we'll all let right, you Dave. Uh, we'll let you run for now and uh, we'll be in touch talk to you soon brother all right have a good one okay you too bye-bye yep bye, -bye.